Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh Brothers and sisters, wherever you are, whenever you are Today I'll talk about an incident that happened to one of my colleagues uh, About three years ago, 2017 One night, he wanted to come approach his wife in the evening And she was tired and she was fed up And just she responded back by swearing at him And insulting his father And cursing his father with the father's name uh, he slept very unhappy and the next day he went to do shopping, then he came back uh, not in a very good mood, not know what to do with her, talk to her, not to talk to her. But he found her coming rushing and running to him, apologizing to him, trying to kiss his, uh, his head and his hand and apologetic and trying to hug him and even ask him to uh, curse his father. As she curses, well. but actually he refused to do that, and the story ended at that, and things came back to normal. An incident like this could make could lead to divorce if if the if the husband is immature, childish, impatient, and if the wife actually did not actually come and did this good behavior. We remember the hadith of the Prophet uh, in the Hujjat al uh, and he was saying, "Oh, khairan." And in the last sermon of Prophet Sallallahu he said, And indeed I order you to be good to the woman, for they are but captives with you, over whom you have no power than that, except if they come with men with, with manifest fahisha, evil behavior, evil behavior, uh, and that's actually uh, uh, what we call about it. So we remember in this uh, story, uh, which is very important, uh, what? We remember how good the woman or the wife in the house, she is the source of uh, happiness to the family, the source even of enjoyment uh, and satisfaction to the husband, the source of protection uh, to the husband from any uh, wrongdoing outside, uh, because she can, she providing him with source of that when he has this matrimonial relationship with her and she's the one who keeps the family together and they keep the children together bringing up the children also she is the one who carrying in her womb all the babies that actually uh, became the children and the men and women of the future and not only that, even during the pregnancy period and during that time if the husband wanted to approach his wife, she is very agreeable to that, to make him happy. All these sort of things she was doing to him has to be, she has to have a favor on her husband and would add our advice to the husband and the wife if something like this happened to be very patient, considering and lenient to another, otherwise it will lead to a divorce. And uh, the brother, alhamdulillah, was very good in actually forgiving this and she was excellent of actually apologizing uh, to do that. This is something actually from the behavior that we need to know as young men and young women when they get married, they don't become hot-headed and angry and say, this is my right and this is her right and this is not right, you have no right or I have, I have my right. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah.